All right, we're here at 8521 Goslin Lane. We walk in, you see this column right here in the foyer. Living room, gas fireplace. We turn here, this the dining room area with the big front window. All the cathedral style ceilings. Again in the living room. Just towards the front door again. As you can see the stairs going up to the second story. Kitchen. Breakfast nook area. Bay window. Take a look at the kitchen. Looks a little dated. Some old appliances. Stove top over here, electric stove. Sliding door which leads to the back. Nice deck though. Looks like it's got a place for a gas line for a barbecue pit. Nice big backyard. Awkward tree line right there, but the yard does go behind that. You can see a big deck. Let's see if we can quickly see. See the yard is a lot bigger behind these trees. There's a view of the back of the house. Let's go back in now. We're going to go back in here into the kitchen. We turn right here, we're going to go into the master suite. Here's the master bedroom. You can see the hardwood floors, vaulted ceilings. Lots of windows. And I noticed over here, you see some kind of crack in the wall down into the baseboard. Pretty good size room. Go into the master bath. You can see the glass tile. Double sinks here and here. Jetted tub with the glass tile again. Stand-up shower. That was that glass tile we just saw. We go through here. This huge walk-in closet. Goes both this way and back over this way. Pretty big walk-in closet here. And then this is the there you go, toilet. All right, we're gonna go back out. This kitchen is a walkthrough, so we're gonna walk through here into this hallway in the front. See, there's the front door right there. Now, it's gonna be a little dark because the lights aren't working, but this is a little awkward half bath. They got the sink here and then the Toilet is back behind this area. It's a little dark, so you won't be able to see, but it's a little awkward. Um, and here again, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but that's the utility room. They do have a sink in there and some cabinets, so it's pretty good size. We look this way, they have two storage closets. We go through this door, have some stairs leading down into a two car garage. Pretty big, big area. So let's see, let's go back, we're going to go back through to the front, back into the living room, and we're going to go up these stairs. Now look, if you can see, some of the stairs are, are starting to fade. We're going to go up these stairs, vaulted ceilings again. Now if you'll notice, I don't know if you can see, but these stairs are a little, a little wobbly, the rail I mean, a little wobbly. Uh, Look back down the stairs. We can go into this bedroom right here. Two windows. 
turn back around. That is one closet. Through the shared bathroom. A vanity here. Toilet. Tub. You can see some of the spots on the wall need to be touched up. Sink for the other room. And here's the other bedroom. Now this one, they're missing a light fixture. This does have the attic access to it as well. There are a few spots on the wall that need to be touched up. There are also a few spots in the other room too. There's the closet. And finally, we're going to go into the... Oh, here we go. A bathroom off the hallway. Again, it's a little dark, but it is just a stand-up shower, a toilet, and that vanity. And then now, finally, the bonus room over the two-car garage in the front. Pretty good-sized room. Dual fans. Three, three windows. That's the bonus room. There you go.